folks, happy Saturday. Let's see how my week went. I have to say uh, I'm pretty happy with what I achieved, what I did, uh, how much work I got done, um, stuff that happened in the video, you will see it at the end. And uh, it was a very good week. Only thing is it's freaking hot, so um, yeah. It's really hard to work in my in my uh, studio, even at night. Um, it's wow, it's so hot. Uh, but I mean, it's summer, so yeah, go figure. Um, let's see if I can survive recording this last few bits of the video here without melting, shall we? Good morning, folks. Happy Saturday. We're getting ready to. Record Gamers Couch for Paperback, which you maybe have seen already once this video comes out because this video here is for tomorrow. So yeah, it's uh, a gray day. It's like uh, already like 3 p.m. We slept way longer than expected. But then again, we did go to bed way later than expected because current news kept us up for a bit. And uh, to be honest, it has been light outside once we got to sleep. So yeah, that's the day, the plan so far. If uh, all goes well, after food shopping and dinner, I might have time to, well, while the gamers coach is uh, rendering and stuff, I might have time to record another episode for Beyond the Lines. Um, Maybe, maybe I got time there. That would be awesome. Just to have things in the can and ready before, uh, well, things get tight when it comes to timing. You know, these videos take a bit longer and I like to take my time with them and not rushing the coloring or the editing, stuff like that. So that's the plan also. Um, I have to color a bit uh, the um, the new page of the um, oh god word um, for the daily marker 30 day coloring challenge I said uh, in the last clip of the last vlog that I had chosen a new page and um, yeah I'm gonna color that and my bracelet is making funny noises that's gonna be hmm that's gonna be interesting when recording the gamers coach that's actually the bracelet that i wore at my wedding this was uh, one of the wedding gifts of my parents for me so yeah it makes funny noises and the other <laughs> voice recorder that is next to this camera is way more sensitive so i hope it doesn't pick it up too much, but we'll see. Anyway, I'm gonna go now. See you in the next clip. So Monday, um, well, Saturday, you just saw. Um, Sunday was game night as per usual, and Monday I did paint my paintings that I wanted to do and then I started editing them and having them voiced over, uploaded, stuff like that and uh, yeah you can see what I voice over. Time to get to work. Enough of the music for now. Oh, I hope I will survive without the AC. So this is just as per usual. I'm voicing over all of my videos. I'm having a very special one next week on Friday. So definitely check that out. Um, come back to the channel that day and after I was done I did uh, work a bit more on planning episodes for Beyond the Lines in the future, uh, getting everything marked and noted what pages I want to use for what project. So I'm flip flipping through all of the books 
and see uh, which pages I want to choose. And then I did record two episodes for uh, Beyond the Lines, one being with Polychromos and the focus is in, on orange, the color orange. And uh, after that, I did also record the Copic Marker Orange episode so that I do have that footage in the can and ready to go uh, when it's time to have it done. It should be end of September, beginning of October that these episodes do come out, if I remember correctly. That is. Sometimes I forget things, but the Polychromos episode took me quite a bit, I think two and a half hours, and I really tried to uh, edit the footage to a point that uh, I don't steal any of your time, but still the episode's like 50 minutes long. It's a really long one, but uh, there's lots of things to say for the polychromos if you work with so few colors but I'm getting ahead of myself you will see that in the video uh, once it's out the Copic marker uh, video that I recorded afterwards was way shorter so it's not every week that I'm gonna have a very long uh, beyond the lines episode for you but um, I mean I'm I cannot rush any thing that I want to tell you and well have have a lesson there. So here's episode two, again with the orange. So yeah, I'm, I'm going through, I think it was six or seven different colors in the future. And then it was Tuesday, time to do uh, scheduling and blogging. And this time around, I was super fast and super goofy and I'm not gonna tell you anything about the footage, you just, have to watch. Pause. This is how quickly you can write a blog post that is for a whole week, all the text and all the stuff, if you have awesome music and you can just jump and rock in your chair. So try it. It's a real helper and it motivates, it puts you in a happy mood and ah, you type along to the rhythm stuff. Yeah. Anyway. On Wednesday, Hobby and I had date night, as per usual, and we tried out a new game that was delivered. Uh, it's called Scythe, and it's a, it's a really cool game. We enjoyed it a lot. Uh, probably gonna play that on Sunday this week. Um, it's definitely gonna come up on the Gamers Couch, so expect an episode about that game very, very soon. And then on Thursday, uh, it was uh, time again to do some work on Draft for Initiative, and we worked on uh, a very special episode again, episode 30, and every 10 episodes we do something uh, a bit unusual, a bit special, you know? So uh, we've been working that out and uh, recording things along. So you can get a sneak peek of things that will come up. And uh, while Tina worked on her part of the, um, of the upcoming painting, I did some coloring because it's still, um, I don't know what, what day, day 20, 21 or something of the 30 day 
uh, coloring challenge uh, of the daily marker and I did uh, start a new underwater scene while Tina was sketching next to me uh, in the hottest studio on earth. So if you're a board gamer and you recognize that game, you know what's gonna come up. I'm not gonna say the name. But yeah, then uh, she went home um, like midnight, <laughs> was super late. Um, but she got a heck of a lot of work done. So uh, we were super successful at that. And um, yeah, it, it was a really, really good time that we had. She's saying bye. And uh, once she was uh, gone, I did start with my part of the painting, working with oils for the first time. Um, it's a bit of getting used to it, but it worked uh, well enough for me to enjoy the process and I'm gonna talk a bit more about that um, experience in the video once it comes out. So you have to wait for a couple of weeks until this episode airs. And uh, if you're new to the channel and don't know, Draw for Initiative airs every Wednesday at 9 a.m. CET. And then once uh, the oil painting was drying, I did work on two more paintings for Draw for Initiative. Again, I'm not gonna tell you the games because, uh, spoiler, but yeah, that was a lot of fun. And uh, then today, Friday, because I have to edit the vlog on Friday, well, technically it's Saturday because it's 2 a.m., but, um, we were at Tina's house, it was her birthday, and we had a lovely uh, getting together and just enjoying ourselves and having fun and stuff, so that was pretty, pretty cool. And uh, afterwards, um, this happened. So, a couple of weeks ago, I had told you that Hubby was building me a structure for filming, and uh, he did all the woodwork himself, so uh, the only thing that was left to do is put it together, and that's what we're doing here. We're um, putting the filming structure together so that I don't have uh, tons of cable uh, cables and stuff uh, in the walking halfway area there and uh, bumping against the microphone holder which holds my camera and stuff like that so uh, just getting things more organized and efficient and that is why the video is uh, titled my husband is the world's best husband um, it was really cool that he built the structure for me and designed it planned it all of, all of that did cut all of the wood and uh, to get everything done. He's, he's having another uh, project for my studio already. It's a storage project that I'm going to show you once uh, we have some progress there. But uh, for now, this is pretty much my new filming area for the two tables that I film at. And it's goddamn awesome! I gotta tell you, it's really cool. The only thing that we got to do tomorrow is um, make the holder for the camera that will be on top. We need the camera tomorrow morning for recording Gamers Couch. By the way, we're gonna have Blood Rage on the Gamers Couch, so uh, check in on Sunday. And um, uh, he's gonna build me very quickly the holder for the camera afterwards. We took measurements and stuff so uh, that everything will be perfect uh, for when it's time to have things done. But I really love it. All my lights are there. I can have my audio recording device uh, clipped to, every, to that section there closer to the table and I have my iPad holder and the lamps are fine. So totally awesome. I have a great husband, don't I? Uh, I mean, I got the world's best husband. I'm very sure of that. There's, yeah. Can you can you see that I love him? Can you? Hmm, I do. So yeah, that was a lot of fun. And uh, well, now I'm just gonna finish editing this vlog and then it's time to wind down for me, do a tiny bit of coloring and then call it a day, a night, a week, whatever you wanna say. It's, yeah, totally fine. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching along and uh, had fun looking over my shoulder and seeing what I did in my studio, what's to come up on the different shows and stuff like that. Um, I hope you will have a great weekend 
uh, enjoy it and have some time. Maybe you got time to create something. That would be awesome. Whatever creative thing you're into, I hope you got some time to, well, do some creative work. Uh, I'm gonna see you in the next vlog. Again, tomorrow we do have the Gamers Couch. And on Monday I'm gonna be back with artwork that, uh, well, is gonna come out. There's an art journal, a tiny Tuesday, Draw for Initiative has a new episode. Um, Beyond the Lines has a new episode. Uh, Friday is very, very special video, so definitely, definitely check in on Friday. And uh, then I'm gonna see you in the next vlog next Saturday with new things that happened in the studio. So enjoy, have fun, thank you again for watching. Do all the good YouTube stuff. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, because it really helps and it would make me very happy. So take care everybody and have a lovely day. Bye!